Hi, this is Professor CC19, and today is May 8th, 2020, day two of the second installment of The Crush is Real. Once again, we are playing five days, five custom levels inspired by real players in order to win some rewards in, uh, in the process, but ultimately the community chest at the end of the fifth day. Let's meet who is the inspiration for day number two. This is John's level. He says Candy Crush helps me balance and bring sweetness to the end of a chaotic day. It's like dessert anytime I want. Hashtag the crush is real. Now, I played this level once already to get a feel for it, and I learned a lot. I actually beat it, but I didn't want to get it off recording. So I'm going to jump in again for my second attempt to see if I can beat it again. And while this loads, I will say... Um, I put out a lot of great content almost every day. I'm not going to ask you to subscribe. However, I will remind you that the button is right there. So we have 20 moves to collect four cherries and 40 layers of waffles. I'm going to hit play, um, not bringing in any boosters. What we need to do is collect the keys. That's our first priority. We have a key in the sugar co up top. That'll unlock the one on the left, then the one on the right, and then the one down the very bottom corner. And there are some dispensers that are really important on this board. The wrap candy dispenser up here will help us collect the ingredients that are going to be coming from this area up at the top left through the portal. We can collect them anywhere. Um, and there's also the stripe dispensers vertical right here on the right in the center towards the right. That's going to help us clear out the waffles on the top right. And then also this horizontal dispenser on the bottom right that's going to help us to clear the waffles on the bottom left. So everything's going to kind of work together, but our job mainly is to collect the keys. I see I have a color bomb right away with the orange, not going to skip that. And I believe that I can move the um, sugar chests, um, sugar coat candies. Let's see if I can. Yes, I can. And I didn't even see that that was going to set up another color bomb, but it will. And we can take out all blue. Oh, no, we can't match it. Uh, we can still take out all blue with this one. And now we need to collect that key. I think a good way to do that would be a color bomb wrapped combo. Because I'm pretty sure this is going to collect absolutely everything on this board. It's going to collect our orange key on the left. Our first ingredient that starts to come through. Some of the waffles. We need one more key. It's on the right. The fact that this ha board has only three colors is the main reason why. I find it pretty easy. All right, there's our second key. And now that stripes are starting to come from this dispenser over on the right, they're going to be key because this stripe, the blue vertical, can hit this key and then start stripes coming from the other dispenser that goes hor uh, horizontally. What I want to do is send off that blue stripe to collect the key. Some form, any form. There we go. And we do have one problem. We have ticking time bombs set at four coming from this dispenser. Um, we just need to draw them through right away. Not too tough to do that, again, because this board only has three colors. But the stripe dispensers are pretty generous. That void gets filled every turn we take. Um, correct me there, not every turn we take, every other turn. But every time we send one off, it's going to hit the horizontal, like that. We just need to keep doing that until we have collected all the waffle layers. See, there's another one. And we somehow got that. I didn't see what happened at the very end, but that's how we beat level two, John's level, in The Crush is Real. As of May 8th, 2020, we have three more levels in this version, and King says it's supposed to go till May 27th, so maybe we'll be seeing one more version by the end of the month. Either way, I think this was a great level, shaped like the number four, which I'm assuming is significant somehow, but yeah, a really fun and clever level. And I think I might have just seen something else with a, maybe a 5. I'll have to look at it again. But either way, we get 30 minutes of free fish. Thank you, John. I like your level, and we'll see who's the inspiration for day 3 tomorrow. 
If you found this video helpful and you'd like to see more, please subscribe. And as always, thank you so much for watching.